If you're thinking about creating a membership site and you're considering using Kajabi, I've got some examples to show you, plus a behind the scenes look at what it takes to get it online. Hi, I'm Terry M. Lee and welcome to my channel that's all about helping you build and sell your online course, membership site, or coaching program without the tech overwhelm, because that's what I do. So. Uh, take a moment to subscribe, uh, help me grow my channel again, get this information out there, uh, hit the notification button so you don't miss another video. So let's jump into today's topic where it's all about membership sites. Now if you aren't familiar with that term, a lot of people are like, well, you know, I want to be able to offer something that's on a weekly or monthly basis and so I get paid all the time. Like who doesn't want to be their own Netflix, right? So I'm going to show you um, what Kajabi comes with as far as creating your membership sites. I'm going to show you even a behind the scenes look at mine and how you can switch it up as well as one of my customers. All right. So here we are and we're looking at this page in Kajabi. It's like your all products. This is sort of my, uh, my demo view of everything. So there's not much live information here, but you'll get the idea. So in our um, back office is as they say in Kajabi we have the ability to create lots of different products so if I click over here on new product I can have a course a mini course and membership and to show you how easy it is uh, I'm going to click this button but we're going to really kind of do the the other one so if I click membership and I click yeah okay to get started it's going to ask me for um, my name that I want my membership to be called, a demo, uh, description, an image, and I can do all this stuff later and I'll just hit the submit button. Now, I don't know about you, but that's like pretty easy and pretty um, not too difficult, not too technical, not too technically challenged uh, to get it up and running, right? You can click a button. And so it'll put all the other pieces together. So there's two main things to know about uh, creating uh, memberships in Kajabi. There's the layout side, like how you want it to kind of look, and then there's adding the content. And you would have that if it were a course or something else. So I'm going to jump out of this one because I've sort of customized the other one. And uh, But you saw that's how hard it was to uh, create the, the uh, structure of our membership site. So over here in my membership demo, if I click on this, and it's going to look just like the one we had before, if I preview it now, it's going to come with um, Kajabi standard template. Um, you know, it's okay, not too sexy, but it's enough to get up, get yourself up and running, um, get your basic layout, and test your hypothesis to make sure everything behind the scenes is working. I tell people, don't overcomplicate it, kind of get going. But let's say, you know, you're like, okay, I, I don't really like that theme. Ken, is there a way I can change it? Yes. So if I go back to my products here and I'm going to, I probably, I could have gotten to this a different way. But if I click on this, um, let's click here, sorry. And if I click customize, I'm going to have the ability to have different templates. Now, there are some that come with Kajabi, and then you can, other people sell customized templates, and I'm going to show you a couple of those and how they look and a little bit about how they differ. So this is where we're dealing with the layout part. What's the look and feel of my um, membership site? So if up here in the right corner, if I do pick theme, I get a different, uh, different layouts that I can have. Um, that I might want to install. And if you install it, it doesn't change your content. That's the important piece. Um, it's only going to change the look and feel. So let's say I want to do this worn one and I would just click this one and it's going to give me the other pages, the other look to see how it looks. I can say get started and then it's going to install my theme. Again, not too difficult, right? I'm loving this, just click a button and get going. And so as you can see down here, I have my different views. Now this is important because let's say you have a live version of your, um, your membership up and running. You don't wanna just willy nilly just change it. So what you can do is you can customize the look and feel and test it out to make sure you like the way you look, way it looks before you make it active. So what I'm gonna do is I'm going to go ahead over here and I'm gonna activate this one. You'll see that it changed here and then we can preview. And so now this is my information. So now these were just dummy images that I put in here for the modules, but you see that this is uh, the templated version, it's a theme, and so therefore that's what it's gonna look like. 
if I decide that I want to try the momentum. Momentum is a very popular um, theme that is used in um, for memberships in Kajabi because it has this sidebar over here um, that a lot of people really like for navigation. So again, look, I didn't change my content. Of course, it's very you know generic because I haven't customized it. But here again, I would, can see. Um, my modules um, these were the core lessons I only put in a couple of images but you get the idea that that's what a membership um, could look like now suppose you're like you know what I really want some oomph I wanted to, to do all these other kind of snazzy things and I found a uh, for pay uh, premium template well you can use that I keep saying template but it's theme is the correct word so what you would do you would buy it from a third-party person and then you would just save it to your computer and then you would upload the theme and drag it in here. Well, I've already done one of these um, already. So this one is uh, one that's by Penny, uh, Penny in Your Pocket. And I have a few things by Penny and I will link to it in the description below. But she has um, templates and uh, custom membership themes that really make it look nice. So if I were to preview this one, now you get to see, you know, there's a little bit more, there's subtleties where I can have my training, but it's, um, ex it's not auto expanded. So that if I have a lot of different things in my membership, I, I don't want it to uh, maybe have this really long navigation. I want it to be sort of tight and not seem overwhelming. And then I can expand upon it um, and do lots of other different uh, customization things. So having said that, let me bring over Penny's theme in action. Um, well, this is, uh, I should say it's a custom theme. I, I've used some of uh, Penny's things too. But you can customize, like I say, um, different look and feel, but how you want uh, things to, to look um, in your membership. And so that's uh, one thing that, uh, that I'm using and uh, customizing uh, using a custom theme. And so um, I want to show you one last one. And this is, I'm so proud of one of my customers who's also a member in my Facebook group who took Penny's theme uh, for her keto site and really did a bang up job in here. Now you may say, whoa, you can do all of this? Yes, um, um, she's done a lot. And so uh, with her membership, I don't want to give away her, her information. So I'm not really going to click on anything in here. But um, this is how she has chosen to lay out her uh, membership site within Kajabi using um, a custom theme, using one of Penny's um, um, themes too. So again, you can start out small, um, use uh, what's built in with Kajabi with one click and then change the look and feel. And then it's about your content um, if I go back over here to all products and click in the uh, membership area, now this is where you would add in your content. You would add in your, your modules, even if you were uh, having it, you know, whatever time frame you're delivering it, every month, every week, or, or what have you, you could have your core training, and then you could have like your bonus content, uh, resources, you could have live Q&As, whatever you decide to put in here and lay it out, um, your content sort of remains the the static portion and then you can change your layout um, by templates uh, whether it's a built-in one or you've purchased one additionally so hopefully you found that helpful if you're interested in kajabi or even in the themes check the links below and that's it for now and i'll see you in the next video